Hey guys, this is Kim and the Wolf, and welcome back to another Minecraft video on Windows 10. Now, this video is for everyone who's been running how to do custom text packs on Windows 10. Now, this video is going to show you guys uh, what you have to do. It's not going to be an in-depth tutorial, so you're going to have to figure out not all of it for by yourself, but uh, it is a little bit, you know... Uh, Difficult. I don't want to say difficult, but it is. It's a little, it has been a little bit more on the hard side because it changed the format for everything. So uh, if I go to my global resources, you guys can see I have a, you know, amazing custom text pack myself. It is based off the city text pack, um, just because I'm that lame, you know. So um, let me go to where we need to go. So this is what it is now okay guys so this is my custom text pack as you can see they changed everything inside the resource packs what it has to look like now they changed everything they reformatted everything in the text pack so this is what it used to look like okay so you used to have images key art pack on uh, pack icon and resources so uh, now what you have is pack icon pack manifest textures and key art so they changed images to textures and inside, they changed a whole bunch of different things. So they added uh, some new folders, such as GUI, and they added uh, different things in the entity. As you can see, they have all the lovely animals in Minecraft in the entity file now. But if you go back to the regular, back to the old way, uh, if you go to entity, it used to only be, you know, three things. So they changed a whole bunch of things in this past update for this now i will be giving you guys a download link to um i believe vanilla i'm probably going to do vanilla for you guys what you know the text pack is or i might just do plastic natural or city for you guys just so you guys can get a feel on what they uh did and all you have to do is copy um and change everything to your liking so as you can see if you go to gui they have, you know, the horse armor. If you go back and go to uh, mob, they have only the three mobs, which is the Wither, Skulker, and Ender Dragon. If you go to uh, painting, as you guys know, it's the painting. So, you know, you just have to replace each different thing to what it used to be. So, like, a boat would be, you know, the boat. So, it's not, it's time-consuming having to uh, re-fixture everything into, you know, different different areas but that's basically all you have to do and then finally the last part is you have to open up you know a JSON editor and you have to change you know um, this lovely lovely thing right here so you have to change the pack ID and you have to change the name so if we go to my uh, texture pack uh, I haven't figured I, I, I have figured it out I haven't done it yet um, which is totally a different video if I go back to custom and I go to my pack manifest and hello blacky chan um you can see that i renamed it custom my pack id is custom my store offer name is custom i just haven't made the description yet which i'll get to eventually so but that is basically it on how you get custom text packs working in minecraft windows 10 beta so if you guys want a uh fuller tutorial on how to do it i can totally see if i can do it for you guys but uh for the most part all you have to do is change a whole few little things you know here and there with the different folders and that's basically it for this tutorial that's all you have to do guys so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video please leave a like and a comment and i would definitely appreciate it this is cameron the wolf and i will catch you guys later in another video bye